Hey people, today I want to talk about this. What you can see here is a Model Y Tesla that drove itself all the way from its factory floor towards its buyer's house. Now, as far as I know, this is only allowed in Austin, but things are changing in the US and they want to use this system all across the US. Now, as far as the drive in itself, it was about a half hour drive. The car drove for about 14 to 15 miles, which is about 24, 25 kilometers and top speeds of about 72 miles an hour. Now, this is an amazing feat of engineering, if you ask me. If people would have told me 20 years ago that the cars would deliver themselves to their buyer's house, I would have bought them a white straight jacket and, well, put them in an asylum. But hey, this is 20 years later. And we have Elon. He has this nag of changing things in ways that companies never mentioned doing. So congrats on Elon. As for Europe, of course, we have to talk about Europe as well. They don't allow it. If a car has an autonomous driving function, like the Teslas, you can activate it, but you're obligated to put both hands on your steering wheel, which basically makes it useless. Now, why is this, you ask me? Here in Europe, the critique, as far as I could find also on the internet, the critique is that a lot of uh, people in government don't trust the camera system. Despite the fact that it works flawlessly now in the US, here in Europe, they don't trust it. And they mentioned the LiDAR system, because Tesla doesn't have the LiDAR system. You know which company does? Mercedes. So yeah, it's all about protecting their own interests. That's... That's the only thing that they're, that they're good at, you know? That's also one of the reasons why we are way back on the technology field. That's the only reason. Anyway, to go back to this clip, what you can see here is history in the making. It's an amazing feat of engineering. And we can only be proud, I say it over and over again in almost every, every video that I post, we can only be proud having people like Elon who changes the world in every single aspect of it and having people in government like Trump who really has a vision towards the future. They could learn a lot from this here in Europe. Anyway, I see you guys in the next one. Take care and have a lovely evening.